Hello everyone, this is Troy from TroyPoint.com and in this quick video I will show you how to install mouse toggle on Fire Stick, Fire TV, or Fire TV Cube. There are many apps that we sideload to our Fire Sticks that don't work well with the remote control because they weren't developed for the television, but the mouse toggle app will take care of that. The first thing I'm going to do is install the free downloader application through the Amazon App Store. After typing in DO, you'll see that it shows up in the list. I'm going to click Downloader, click the big orange icon, download it, and it will install. Okay, it has installed. I don't want to open it just yet. I'm going to go back to the home screen. I'm going to hover over the gear icon, move down, click My Fire TV, and I want to go into Developer Options. Now, if for some reason this is not listed here, you can enable that by going into About, highlight the name of your Fire TV device, and click it seven times. You'll see at the bottom it says, No need, you are already a developer. Now, if you haven't already enabled this, it will say you are now a developer, and then when you go back to the previous screen, Developer Options will be listed here. Go into that. And the first thing you want to do is make sure that you turn on ADB debugging. If this is off, highlight it, click the OK button on your remote, and that will turn it on. The next thing you want to do is go into Install Unknown Apps and turn on Downloader. Okay, once we've done that, I'm going to go back to the home screen, go into the location where I can find all of my applications, Launch Downloader, click Allow, click OK, and now I'm going to click the Up button on my remote and put the cursor in the URL box. Click the OK button on my remote, and now I'm going to type in 250931. Hit the Go button. This will open the free TroyPoint toolbox that provides applications that aren't available within the Amazon App Store. All right, the TroyPoint Toolbox screen has loaded. Now, if this is your first time landing on this page, I strongly suggest marking this as a favorite within the Downloader app. To do that, simply hold down on the OK button of your remote for a few seconds, click Add Current Page to Favorites, click Save, and now when you move over to the left side, it will be in your favorites section. So the next time you come in here, you can easily go to that. You don't have to type in the code and you don't have to wait for that five second load screen with the ads. Okay, now I'm gonna scroll down until I find the mouse toggle app for the Fire Stick. And here it is right here. Now you're gonna notice that this page has dozens of applications that you can download and install. Simply click the download button. And if you wanna learn more about the app, all you have to do is click the tutorial button. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and download Fire Stick Mouse Toggle. Click Install. I'm gonna click Done. And the reason I do that, I want to delete the Mouse Toggle APK file. There's no need to leave these installation files on the device. Delete and delete again. Now I'm gonna click the Home button on my remote Go back to the page that shows all of my apps. Mouse toggle is here in this list. I'm going to go ahead and launch it. Now, when this page shows up here, you must check off the box that says Always Allow from this computer. Go ahead and just click the OK button on your remote to check that, and then click the OK button. Now, you're going to see a status indicator bottom left-hand corner, and right now it's showing error. Go ahead and ignore that and try double clicking the play pause button on your remote. And you should see the pointer. Now, if you don't see the pointer, what I suggest doing is disable the mouse service with that top toggle. Wait a few seconds for it to turn white, come up, and then re-enable it. And again, I'm getting that error code on the bottom. 
but like I said, it's still working when I double press the play pause button on the remote, as you'll see here. And now I'm going to click the home button on my remote. This will continue running in the background. And I'm going to open an app where the mouse toggle comes in handy. This is Virus Total. You can get this through the free Troy Point toolbox as well. So you're going to see here, it's not really meant for a remote control experience. This is meant for an Android phone or tablet. And by enabling mouse mode by double clicking the play pause button, we can get around here much easier. And then another nice feature that you will find with the mouse toggle for Fire Stick is that you can scroll on pages such as this. So if I click the fast forward button of my remote and keep clicking it, you're going to see it scrolls down the page. And now when I click the menu button and keep clicking it, it scrolls up the page. So again, nice solution for these applications that don't work well with the remote control. Mouse toggle for Fire Stick is definitely the answer. And then if you ever want to get out of mouse mode, simply double click the home button or click the play pause button and it will return to regular mode. So that is how you can install mouse toggle for Fire Stick, Fire TV, Fire TV Cube, and it also works on Fire TV televisions as well. Guys, thank you very much for watching this video. Please be sure to hit the thumbs up button, subscribe to my channel, and click the bell icon to be notified when I drop new tutorials like this in the future. And also be sure to take a look at all the awesome applications in my free Troy Point toolbox. Have an awesome day, and thanks for following Troy Point.